What is going on, people? Welcome back. I hope you're all still alive and cooped up in your house like me right now. We're going to have to turn this thing off. Well, we have one meal in her pocket, but we do have survival meals. We need this this harvest of rice to come in, and then we'll be okay. I might have overbuilt these. Maybe we can dedicate one of these to cotton once we get some rice stockpiled here. I really just want to get out and do something, but we can't go outside. I would go mine or break something down, but she's got this negative 12, and as soon as she steps outside, she gets an extra minus 16 from the cold temperature, and that pushes her way down if she has a mental break. Most likely she's going to die. So once again, it's the old RimWorld waiting game. When is the psychic drone going to end? <laughs> but at least we're above the break zone. Scratch that. Recreation unfulfilled. But we can't go outside. Let's try this. Let's try this. I don't think she'll recreate because now she's too tired. Look at that. You could have eaten with a table. You chose not to. We're going to keep doing this until you eat with that. There it is. Hope we can't have any more minus threes stacked on top of this business. Okay, so she's not going to recreate till morning. I took this thing down so she would meditate or pray or something. But maybe by morning the psychic drone will have gone away. We barely held on with the power there. Bloody hell. Okay, there you go. She got up and started praying as soon as she woke up. And then when she's done with that, we can just reinstall that. And the psychic drone continues. It's been 1.2 days. I think we're out of food. So we're going to have to come over here, pick up one of these. Did you take two? Yeah, she's hauling one. Come back in here. Forbid those. Forbid this. <laughs> You're not even hungry. Oh, you are hungry. Son of a bitch. All right, let's see if we can get this rice just to grow a little bit, and then we'll reconnect, reconnect. It's almost harvestable. Some of it is like a butt hair away here. Jeez Louise. The psychic drone sucks. <laughs> That's Rimworld right there to a frickin' T. Like. Alright. Or everything's harvestable now, so as soon as the wind dies, we're harvesting it. Oh, very nice. We can now do machining. We did get carpet, I believe, indeed. We know we're going to want all these things. We need to actually get through to the ship, so it's fine to do it. It'd be nice to have a plant worker. It'd be nice to have somebody who can mine. Yes, yeah, so as soon as this power dies, or... Hmm, so tempted right now. Oh, good, the psychic drone ended. Perfect. You know what? Let's just harvest the plants. What are we going to get? So we're still going to get that crappy amount that we got last time, but that's okay. One more effective round of... Now what are you doing? You're praying. Get in there, dude. <laughs> All right, the temp's holding, so we shouldn't lose it here. She is botching. That's too botched. All right, at least the temp held. You can pray or do whatever the hell you need to do now. All right, the wind's coming back. I might as well leave that off until she replants everything. Oh, geez, Louise. Come on. So, so, so. <laughs> there. And we're going to need this installed next. And we can probably allow that. So we have not quite four meals. She was going to eat 15 of those. So you definitely do yourself a favor by 
cooking them up. Yeah, minor break risk, sure. There, no. You better be hungry. She's definitely hungry. All right, there you go. So now we just need some wind. Our next goal is to build this damn thing, <laughs> whatever it takes. I think we're going to try and get this. You know what? Maybe we deconstruct the bed and build the new bed. There's nowhere for a table in here. So that's a non-issue. I can build a stool and leave it here, but we can't research then. And then she's going to be bored 90% of the time. All right, well, we can definitely reconnect this. Where are you headed? I like that we got like two meals out of that. She's going to try and eat without a table out here, so we need to watch that. It's negative 143. She is shivering. This feels like a bloody lost cause, right? Yeah. Get back inside. So you go there. Oh, shit. Don't get frostbite. Wait, she should have a meal in her pocket. Okay, she does. She did use that. That's good. Let's get that hauled out. She's taking the rice out, but I guess I don't give a shit. Oh, no, she's not. Well, can't let you go outside until... And you're going to wander. Need, uh, this should definitely not be turned on. I'm such a dummy. Needs. We're looking at health, actually. Shivering. Here, let's uninstall this. In a pinch, we can eat that raw rice as well. Man, as soon as she's better, I think we're just going to get out. Look, it's the warmest part of the day here. She's been bloody shivering all day. Needs. All right. Uh, she might take that outside right away. Go we'll stand over there for a minute. Oh, I thought we were getting an event there. Nope. All right, let's deconstruct, and let's run over there and do it, and let's watch the health. So if she gets to, like, 20, 25, then she's going to need to go back. Look how slow it goes. Holy shit. And you can't stop her when she starts because then you'll never finish. Come on. Pause. All right. There you go. Are we going to make it is the next question. Yes, we're definitely going to make it. We might get injured, but nothing yet. Come inside. Come inside. Forget it. Forget it. Yes. <laughs> All right. That's a success. Gear. She has one meal, steel and components. So that's going to give us 86. Where's the next closest one? <laughs> 135 in the night. Okay, so it's 136 at 20 hours. It might be getting warmer at this time of the day. No. No, don't do that. Pick it up. No, I said pick it up. Go over there. Eat it at the table. That's it for the meals. Once again, we are out. Come over here. I guess we'll grab that meal next time she's hungry. All right. I think I'm going to allow this stuff. We could. Ah, oh, gosh. I should have made this room one tick bigger. <laughs> With the heat situation, you know, you can't really rely on anything. All right, we're going to forbid this. I'd rather eat these packaged survival meals. I'm going to allow that. I'm going to allow this. We're going to come over here and pick this up. And we're going to go back inside. And we're going to disallow that. We're going to do that. It's probably really gross in here now that she's got the... Oh, it's mediocre now. Very nice. I'm not sure how that happened. She needs to recreate. Let's see if we can... And go outside and use the... Nope, she's not going to do that. I don't want you to go over there. Okay, so... Cancel that. Go back inside. All right, yeah. Bring supplies over there. That's fine. Hey, I should not have allowed that to happen. 
now you're going to try and use the bloody horseshoe thing since you're freezing your ovaries off. Good job. And that's going to have to be good enough, lady. And let's forbid that and chill for a minute. No. Needs. All right, draft. Pick it up. Go over there. Drop it. Undraft. There you go. How are we doing on this? This is at 61%, so we're almost ready to harvest them again. <laughs> so we really didn't get ahead at all. <laughs> oh. I might just have to eat the rest of the package survival meals and let her... We only have three left, which is a little terrifying. Now the power's out. Reconnect the power over there. So now that it's not growing. All right. I wonder, I bet, we could deconstruct the bed. Make a new bed out of silver. So furniture. Bed, silver. I'm going to put it right there. I guess you can bring supplies over there. That's fine. Let's get all this stuff brought over here. And then let's come inside. Forbid all this. It should be lit here because those heaters put off a little light. And then as soon as she's not freezing, we'll let her build the silver bed. And with the steel we pulled from that, we can get our other windmill going. And allow that. You better not be cold. Pow. It's poor. Of course it's freaking poor. It's made out of silver, though. <laughs> it's got that going for it. All right, you're not allowed to work on that while you're cold, either. Uh, here, let's... Let's pick these up. Let's go here. Let's drop them. She should put them on top of the other ones. Beautiful. Let's go back over here. All right, she's still shivering. All right, good. Let's get out there and build that. And should be okay, I pray. Now, stool, furniture, silver stool. We need 250. We are a far cry from 250. What do we have for steel? We have 18. At least this should solve our power issues, right? Look at this. Now you're talking. Okay, so we should be good for power. We are. Beautiful. I mean, they're all kicking pretty good, but we have a ton of extra power coming in. We should also watch her issue is here. <laughs> and time to go inside. Now, next thing that's important, we need this food. We have no food. I'm going to let these mature for one more day. And I want you to draft up. I want you to come over here and pick one of these up. And then come over here. We'll forbid those. Man, you just love to eat without a table. Pick it up. Go over there. If you trap her in there, she just doesn't know where to go. <laughs> what are you doing? Hauling your... Literally combining silver. All right, so the power situation is solved. That's fantastic. We're recreating outside. It's negative 125. Oh, so like I was saying, I think the temperature at night is better than the temperature during the day. So I... Th oh, geez. I need to pay attention to the midday temperature. In which case, we're going to switch her sleep, sleep in... Awake cycles around. Needs. Well, she's tired. She just won't go to bed. There you go. All right. Well, there's an eclipse on, but that does absolutely nothing to us. I'm trying to figure out what the plan was for food. <laughs> the rice is 73%. I guess we just have to harvest it, right? Because she doesn't have a meal. 
There's no meals laying about, and she's really hungry. Is that where we're at? Am I missing something? All right, let's go ahead and harvest them. And then we need to get this installed as well. We'll turn it off for the minute. I'll let the power build. And that should get us enough to make a meal. It does. Now let's reconnect. Come over here. By the time we're done with this, the rest of the food should be already good. She's going to cook, which is perfect because she's very hungry. We're going to draft up, pick it up. Ah, shit, pick it up. Come over here, eat it. There you go. Bam. Now she should pluck things. We're only getting three at a time here, which is not ideal. Man. Well, it must just be shitty luck. Which I feel like we've had in droves. There's a botched. So she botched two. At least two, maybe three now. Oh, you suck so bad. If she wouldn't have botched that many. Uh, let's forbid this. We don't even have enough for another bloody meal. Well, we might end up eating the package survival meals. What are your needs? Let's turn this off. Yeah, maybe if we let those eat these... With the rice will fully mature. We'll get a better situation. Slept in the cold darkness. And feeling pretty good overall, though. It is the middle of the night. We should probably just not go outside, right? <laughs> She's meditating, so that's good. What kind of madness is that? That's really close to Kelly. Kelly has a sweet afro. Kelly has some decent gear. Oh, my God. She's probably unhealthy, right, because of her age? Yeah, we can't deal with that. We're just going to have to strip her, but it's free stuff, and it might be better than what we're wearing. Kelly, you landed in the wrong spot, my dear. It's definitely not too cold for us to get over here. And off you go. I want you to come down here first. Kelly is going to be laying on the ice for the rest of eternity. All right, and then let's come over here. How bad are you? Not too bad at all, actually. Gear. Drop that. I wish Kelly would have had some bloody meals with her. Oh, we, yeah, we have a few. Let's go over there. Undraft. What are your needs? You're going to want that food soon. Okay, so Kelly had a cloth t-shirt, 82%. What is the insulation cold is 7.1. We have a Synthread button down, which is 10.3. But Kelly also had some wolfskin pants. Nah, they're only 8.6. That doesn't bode well. Versus alpaca wool, which is 10.1. All right, never mind. Carry on. And let's see. It's nighttime health. She's still shivering. The power is having some struggles. Pick up the meal. Go over there. Eat the meal. Needs. She's not shivering. I think we can take her out and actually do something here. There you go. She, oh, she's going to actually go out on her own. <laughs> All right. Now, we could go take these apart, and I think that would be a good play. There you go. So health. Oh, yeah. She should be just fine. Unless that's going up. I mean, it's going up pretty fast. <laughs> And the temperature is not super terrible. She's going to stop and try and eat a bloody meal. Watch. No. Wow. Good deal. Okay, good. We didn't let her take a meal with. <laughs> All 
All right. Uh, there's your hypothermia. Oh, we have some frostbite. Double frostbite. Nice. And we're at serious at 52%. Let's just head over this way. Three frostbites. You have to be shitting me. That could have been a lot better. Let's get inside. Let's disallow that. Let's come over here. Drop the components so we don't have to pick those up later. Undraft. Allow. So when she tends, she should use the medicine, which is what I want her to do. There you go. And bedtime. Needs. Observed a rotting corpse. Son of a bitch. It was this dude. Boffin, you son of a... Oh, well. She's sleeping. All right. Well, I think it's break time. So what I'm going to do is let her heal up and pray. She doesn't get any permanent injuries. But in the meantime, we'll give a cheers to the patrons. Dirtle Dave, Corneal B, JT, Seamus, Michael Rakestraw, Wake Motto. Hey, the eclipse is ending. <laughs> Frederick Dapper Go, Jalison, Thalburn, Henry Wallace, Alexander, Tyrant X, Typhios, Viking Brandon Blaze, Dr. Ape, Jason Kane, Shiggy, and President Lux. In roughly the order they signed up, but not exactly anymore. So next time, I think we're going to see if we can't claim these. Try and get these. Based on how slow it goes when she deconstructs, uh, this one feels like it's going to be a bridge too far, but maybe we can pick up this slag up here. And after that, I guess it's worthwhile to start mining. We need to get some trade set up as well. One bulk goods trader, after, if we could mine these out, get a bulk, bulk goods trader, we could buy a fair amount of stone. That would be ideal. Anyways, thanks for watching. Leave me a like. It does help me out. I would very much appreciate it. Please consider some support over on Patreon. A buck or two a month would make all the difference to me, and it's literally almost no impact on your budget, even during these trying times. Talk about isolation. She's social distancing here. But anyways, I'll see you guys next time.